don't worry, this clip is 14 minutes long. It's just there so you have the experience of seeing my pretty face or gross looking face, kind of girly looking face with a lot of facial hair and masculine features to dry out the girly ones. But anyway, I'm going to talk about the difference between a taxation and a due. Because a lot of people um, I've spoken to actually said something like this. Uh, yeah, well, I agree that taxation is very, very inconvenient. And I don't think that corporations... I mean, I don't think that individuals should be taxed. I don't think that incomes should be taxed. I think only corporations should be taxed by governments for taking resources. And I know um, the typical arguments that the te capitalist takes resources that are mutually owned and by doing so he actually seeking resources not just from society but also from nature and as a process as a result he's very much owing these people so he needs to pay up with taxation and that corporations and firms should be taxed now I'm not gonna get into that kind of language barrier and what a corporation happens to be or things of that sort but I can tell you this that isn't taxation that's a do and what this individual actually said was that uh, I was just saying that because of the whole taxation's evil argument which is kind of a straw man but he knows it and he's just trying to play jokes on me but in actuality, there's a difference between a fine line between a taxation and a due. A due is whatever is owned, whereas tax is the sum of money that's being demanded by government for support of its facilities or surveys levied upon incomes, properties, or sales. Now, a due is just whatever's owed at the present. And if you do support a due, then, um, well, everyone supports a due. It doesn't matter. It's not, unless you're an anarcho communist, you could be a primitivist and still support a due of some sort. It's whatever is owed at the present. And, someone does take any sort of resources from the mutually owned facilities or nature then they'll have to pay a certain due this isn't the same as taxation in any way possible other than it not being completely voluntary because you can't just say oh no I I'm not gonna pay for this shit. But with that kind of argument, you're just being a complete cockswine who ignores reality. Um, because it's even if this is enforced by polycentric legal agencies or an extremely small scale of populations a monocentric legal agency then it isn't being levied for services that are handed to you by that government agency it's being handed to you for whatever you actually owe and here's an analogy that would complement what I just said imagine if you're taking a shower and then this random girl who's muck and that's a dick Makes your vagina a really small dick. Comes out of nowhere and fucks you in the ass. And then she says, Oh, you owe us money. Because this is going around everywhere. We're doing these services for people. And. Yeah. If you don't pay up, then you're. 
not supporting the levied legal services by that government agency. And that'd be taxation. Taxation for that sort of service. Now, if it were in a different situation and this girl was kind of like a mutually owned whore, she kind of fucks everybody, and then you actually like a do something out of your way that breaks that mutual ownership of that hoe and smash that, then you do owe money and that's a do. You can make the argument that all taxations are dues, but not all dues are taxations. My parents and siblings are listening to this. They think I'm kind of crazy, but whatever, I don't give a crap. Anyway, that's pretty much all I have to say. Wow, my room was really messy at that time. This was a pretty old ass uh, video that I'm using stock footage from. I, I don't even think it was released. Let me check before I end the video. What was this talking about? Now, Seamus' is good ass move set. Oh, yeah, Mark it's Henry. that raw video. I might do more wrestling videos. Who knows? But who cares?